How was 2017? Did you make some changes? Did you improve some things that you wanted to improve? Did you increase your thrift savings plan? Sure, we have some time left, but I think now you should start reflecting on how 2017 went and some things that you want to change for 2018. The reason I say this is because 2018 could be your best year yet, and I'm going to give you a reason, at least one reason why, based on regulations, 2018 could be your best year yet for the thrift savings plan. So if you're in the thrift savings plan, your goal is to accumulate as much money as you can in there, earn as much interest as you can so you have as much money as possible in your retirement. I mean, for most people, that's the goal of the thrift savings plan. So you're not just putting money away for no reason. Most people put money away because they have a specific reason later on in life. And if you don't have a specific reason, you gotta come up with some because it will motivate you to you know, continue to increase your contributions to the thrift savings plan. Now, the reason I'm making this video is because the IRS came out recently and made new limits for 2018 for contribution programs, for retirement programs, including the thrift savings plan. And the limit is, has actually increased, okay? And so we've seen this just about every year. The IRS continues to increase the amount of money that you can put in your retirement plan. Or as a federal employee, the amount that you can put in your thrift savings plan. And the more that you contribute to your thrift savings plan, the more that you can contribute to your retirement programs, oftentimes the better off you're gonna be in retirement so long as you're allocating those things in a proper manner. And the market doesn't just absolutely you know, terrorize yourself over the next 10, 15 years. All the way back in 2007, the limit for you know, contributions was $15,500, okay? That was the standard limit. The max contribution, if you were above 50, the catch-up provision was 5,000, okay? So that was, that was the limit, that was the max that you could put in there. And basically, a lot of times due to inflation and maybe some other factors, the IRS decides to, let's increase the amount that people can contribute to the thrift savings plan, can contribute to the retirement plan. And so 2017, the amount that you could contribute was $18,000, okay? So you could contribute $18,000 to your thrift savings plan. And then if you were over 50 years old, you could contribute $6,000. So you could contribute in total $24,000 to your thrift savings plan in 2017. And some of you have already done that. Some of you are going to do that for the year. And I applaud you. That's awesome that you're able to stuff so much away for retirement and you're planning in that manner. For 2018 though, they're increasing that limit by $500. So they're going from 18,000 to 18,500. Now for some of you, it's like, ah, that's $500, that's not that big of a deal. But what I think, you know, people that have a long-term perspective, they think, okay, 500 more dollars. Well, if I look at that over a longer period of time, okay, so I, I extend that out and see what 500 additional dollars in my, my retirement program could do if my account increased by a certain amount, you start to understand that $500 can make a big difference on your retirement. And so that's really what I'm trying to tell you today is every dollar that you put away into your retirement plan counts, it matters. So if you put in you know, 18,000, that's great, but next year you're gonna be able to put in 18,500, which means you have an even, even better chance of meeting your goals in retirement from a financial standpoint. And you need to make sure that every dollar matters. And so when I asked you, you know, how was 2017 for you? I was really just trying to figure out, was 2017, did you make the decisions that you wanted to? Did you contribute the amount that you wanted to contrib contribute to your retirement program? Because if you didn't, that's fine, but you have the opportunity to contribute that amount in 2018, and not even that, you can contribute even more in 2018, which gives you a greater opportunity. So make sure you're maximizing the opportunities that you have from the federal government because they're not necessarily always gonna be there. There's been talks about you know people lowering the amount, the IRS lowering the amount that you can contribute to 401k plans, to 401k type plans, which would include the TSP. So this amount may not always be allowed. And one of the great things about the TSP is you contribute that 5%, you get the match, but 
you can contribute you can continue to contribute more than that and if you do so your fees will still be low through the thrift savings plan due to the low expense ratios. So some to be on the watch out for, some to be aware of. You have a great opportunity in 2018, so maximize it. This has been Cooper from FedRetirementPlanning.com. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you'd like to see next. See ya. I don't